Welcome to the Reunion Show. My name's Uriah. I'm Braxton Jacobs. Tucker Buhalls. And today we're reviewing three items from my 05 Chevy Tahoe. First item off of three, we're reviewing a six inch lift kit for a 05 Chevy Tahoe. Uh, this lift kit is made by Rough Country. Uh, it's a pretty nice lift kit. World made. Rough Country is a pretty nice business to buy lift kits and other things off of. And the price for this item is around $1,259. And on a scale 10, I'll probably rate this a 10 out of 10 because the quality and like the craftsmanship of this lift kit and the way it looks on your V looks pretty nice. Yeah, it looks good, but it's a lot of money. And it says 10 hours to install. That's quite a while. And that be make your car out of commission a lot because it'd take a while. So it's cool and all. It looks really clean. I'd probably rate it a eight and a half out of ten. And like the six inch loving cut, you think it's pretty big, but it's actually not that tall. It's actually pretty nice. It just depends on what tire size you go with. If you go smaller, it looks decently. You can get in there without a lift board. Tuck, how do you feel about this? I think it's really nice, but to think. 10 hours plus times by two because rust and stuff, you'd have over 20 hours of work just on a vehicle that you won't be able to drive very much because it's gonna be very rough. Nah, I don't think, I don't think I'll ride rough. I think I'll ride pretty nice. Cause yeah. the craftsmanship in here is pretty nice. I heard a lot of great reviews about rough country lifts. They actually ride pretty nice. They probably do. Eh, but probably a 9, easy. I'd rate it a 9. Did you rate this? Yeah, 8.5. 8.5? Alright, for the next item we have... Some off-road rims for his Tahoe. They're pretty cool. I like the design on the inside of them. They look really clean. They'd match all the black on his Tahoe. And they're... 400... Yeah, they're four hundred. They're one thousand seven hundred and eighty-four dollars for a set of four. So, yeah, um, they look pretty nice. I'm not sure if they're worth that much. Yeah. But probably uh, like a seven out of ten. What about you, Rira? I think these rooms look pretty clean. They fit the car. They fit the car. They look pretty clean. I like the design and stuff. You'll see it when I we pop it up on here. And the design, the, it's pretty good. The depth is pretty good. It's not that far in. It's not like a fishbowl. It has some depth to it. I'll probably rate this on a scale of 10 and probably an 8.5. How do you feel about this, Tucker? Actually, they look really cool from the pictures. I don't know if I would put them on my pickup because they're too expensive. But if I could buy them and they were, go for a really good price, I would buy them no matter what, I would try and get them. Yeah. So I would rate them a 10 out of 10, easy. What about the next item, Tucker? A GM 2004 to 2006 5.3 supercharger, intercooled complete kit. This looks really cool That's for important. The cost it is. It's $7,499. That's a lot of money, but if you have a good engine that's going to last a long time, if you built it right, yeah, you could have that engine forever. Yeah, this kit actually looks really nice. Give you, and you can tune it, you know, so you can have some power to your. Because I know what the base model tall makes, what, 400? 256. So you can probably bump it up to 400, 300, you think? If you get enough boost, yeah, you could put it up to 500 easy. Oh yeah, and but you can you need hear the new crank, crank rods and a whole bunch of stuff and pistons yeah. and stuff to. But you keep it light. I don't think you have to do all that. Yeah, you depending on how much boost you put in. If okay. you put a lot of boost in, yeah. What yeah. would you rate it, Tucker? I'd rate it a 10 out of 10 for the right engine. Build of engine. What about you, Uriah? Uh, I'll probably rate this a 10 out of 10, because I think this will look pretty nice for it. It'd look nice, but can't get over the cost. It's quite a bit. It but is quite a lot. I feel like it'd be nice once you get it in. It'd probably take forever to put it in. But 
I'd probably rate it like a 9.5 out of 10. Not quite 10 out of 10, but pretty much up there. All right, that's all the items we have for you today. Hope you see you, I hope you see you next week. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See